Hello everyone, my name is Winona Chith Fasabath. I am 16 years old and I am Cambodian and Laotian. Today I decided to share a piece of me that I will always be proud of. It all started with the Khmer Rouge around 1968. The Khmer Rouge was a communist party that started the Cambodian genocide. Families were forced to work under them. If anyone retaliated, they would be severely punished. They were given small rations of food. If anyone tried to steal more rations, they would also be either killed or punished. But how this connects to me is because of my grandparents, my grandpa and my grandmother. In Cambodian, we call grandpas Tha and call our grandmothers Yai. During the genocide, my grandfather fought in it. He was a refugee. My grandfather managed to escape from Cambodia with my grandmother with a few of his siblings one dead and one missing. My grandparents soon started moving toward Thailand and had their first child, my uncle. Along the way, they had more children and told they had five kids, the third one being my mother. They had my mother here in California. If my grandparents didn't escape, honestly, I don't think I would be where I am today. Thanks to them, my mom would have probably never met my father, thus not being able to have me. I'm so grateful to have such a strong and loving mother. This family is not perfect, but yet nothing in life honestly is. Either way, I still love being a part of it, and I can't imagine being without it. Because of these things my family has endured, I am the person that I am today. I am the first great-granddaughter, I am the oldest amongst my cousins and my siblings. I am an artist. I am Winona Chip Fasaba. You don't gotta worry, girl, I'm curving these bitches. There for me and my worst from the rag to the riches. When I was down and out, you helped pull me out of the trenches. Knew it was fate when we met, I fell in love in an instant. Now listen, I swear to God, baby, you can have my whole heart. Love your confidence, plus your book and street smile. I'ma hold you down, girl, ain't nothing gonna change, so won't you? Do me the honor of taking my last name, Queen.